just saw a video pop up about the uh, secret space program. I'm pretty sure that time will <clears throat> show that it's either quantum psychological warfare since all is mind but warfare for what? training for what? it's almost Easter Last Easter, I couldn't walk for 13 days at least. It was truly terrible. The journey to paradise may begin in hell may not. The road to hell may be paved with good intentions. Bad intentions don't seem to be of any use. Not that I have any, unfortunately. Even when I screw up, I'm trying to do the right thing. That's uh, unimportant. I don't know who even taught me. It's easier to say nobody ever taught me anything. In my formative years, what did I learn? Torture, suffering, neglect, abuse rejection, that I'm different, that I'm going to die. It's not even complaining. I'm not even complaining at the moment, I'm just saying the truth. It's possible. <clears throat> well, as Joe M said, whatever I want, I can't have. And whatever the opposite. What I don't want, I can't have. So I can have what I've always had. with some good days and a lot of evil based out of confusion which is intentionally caused with no alternative. None. So, since I only speak the truth as a matter of fact, um, 
trying to think what Easter should be like this year. My opinion may not matter at all. I could try to avoid it and run to the woods. I slept in the woods once. The ground sucked all the heat out of me. I woke up vomiting. My cat found me in the woods. It was very fucking dreadfully deathly. I don't see any way to live in this world which is listening to me and doing what I say. While not letting me have what I want, it, it's absolutely doing what I want. It, the world, hating me while it does so, blaming me. Maybe. Who knows what love even feels like sometimes, you know? She looked at me so harshly last night. At least through one channel. I blinded her with science the night before, apparently. Maybe. It wasn't intentional. Trying to make one person happy, you can make the entire universe unhappy. Listening to people is not the same as obeying. Listening to ghosts, poltergeists, God. The goddess. The goddesses, the goddess. And I just keep complicating things. With no... Absolutely... No alternative. Easter... Ishtar... I said I was going to close the portal to the abyss. But I guess before closing it, it had to be opened. At least in my world. So we'll have sex and see how we feel. After that, I guess Easter is going to be on my mind until Easter. I don't know that I will or won't ever be able to actually live something that anyone would reasonably call a life in this world, whatever it is. It was arrogant of me to come to Earth at all. I must have been angry or horny. Probably both, I'm assuming. I'm not going to assume it was uh, out of any merit. I 
other than bringing wrath. Which to me doesn't seem very meritorious at all. It probably isn't. It's probably wrong entirely. I don't know if the comforter even existed until me. But now apparently I fuck everyone in the world. Just about. Of course, it has to be consensual. So. And I'm straight, so it's only women. They are only, not only, but women that I sleep with or don't. Who knows such things? <laughs> What's downstairs? The moon. A white glove with a drop of blood. Terrible. Terrible, 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 terrible. In this world, everyone turns into someone else. Just to look through someone else's eyes, maybe. I thought that's why she urged me to become promiscuous to begin with. Promiscuous. A very puritanical, sexist word. So it's nice to at least hear it applied to a man, I guess. If I'm not going to be able to live in this world and have a wife, let alone all my Illuminati wives in no disrespect, I'm not trying to Maybe I am. I should be. Because... Do they even say they love me anymore? I haven't heard it in a while. Is my fault? You get, you know, you want to have an experience, you can have that experience with me. If you don't like it, I don't blame you. It's kind of like my situation. This Courtney Love said, you get what you want, you never want it again. Go on, take everything, take everything I want you to. I don't know if I can survive another Easter. I couldn't walk for 13 days. I couldn't even, I couldn't move my legs at all. Not because they were paralyzed, but because the pain was goddamn excruciating. Excruciating agony. I ended up in the emergency room. My blood pressure was so high, they said, how they know my name was Zero. They said your name might as well be Double Zero. I don't know if Jeffrey Epstein ever existed. I'm not sure this I'm not sure about this world. If it's a spiritual world, it's run run by women and you may as well finish me off on Easter, I guess. Yeah. But if I want that, I can't have it. Is that still how it works in hell? If the way to hell is paved with good intentions, how the hell do you 
You know, a lot of people like how so they can say they tried. At least I tried. But it's a it's as much a movie as it is anything else. Is it not? I mean it's not too difficult to predict who I'm gonna see tomorrow. If you know I'll talk to whoever and you know what I'll say. So it's not that. You want to say it's my own fault for staying home, choosing to make a living with my mind? My body was already crippled. But there's all kinds of ways to blame anyone. And there's millions of ways to blame me. So, since I want to live forever, then you should definitely, and all you women of the world should definitely eat me and finish me off on Easter. Not much, except for more of the same, can be worse than it was last year. So, <sighs> if the whole world is still really real and out there, and this is really the world. then just kill me. All you women on Easter, just, you know, you can do it because you love me and I'm in pain. You can do it because you hate me. You got reasons. self-sacrifice it's not even self-sacrifice it is self-sacrifice saw a picture the other day and felt like I was growing out of the ground the dead rising. So maybe I gotta die here to rise somewhere else. They'll be okay without me here anyway. Which is true. And I remember years ago worrying that right around this time I'd be replaced. in my daughter's life, so looks like 50% chance that's what's gonna happen. So there's at least a 25% chance that I'm not gonna make it through Easter. Seems like decent math. Yeah, you can say I know better, but I don't. If I do, then anything I would say would sound egoic. It's a lose-lose. Always. Then great sex and a lot of fun. And then pain. So...
Maybe that's what's been missing from Easter. Halfway through, we'll make love. How's that? What can I say? Something else? Something else.